finally met them in the summer of 2013. I had been with Johnny for over a year, maybe like a year and a half at this point, is my best guess. And I was dying to meet them, you know, dying to get to know these kids. I felt like I knew them already. Uh, I had his daughters, uh, and actually, and Jack's, his, both both of his kids' art on my fridge, and I had never even met them. You know, Johnny had brought them over one day and kindly given them to me, and I had them up on my fridge because I felt like I knew them, just how much he talked about them. And I finally got to meet them um, at the Lone Ranger premiere at Disneyland. Uh, yeah, summer 2013. period of getting clean and sober, he would tell me, you saved my life. Baby girl, you saved my life. Everyone else was saying that to me, and I believed it. You know, if it, everyone else was saying it, he was saying it. I thought, just like his other friends who had gotten clean and sober and stayed that way, his older friends, these rock stars that he hung out with that had, like, gotten clean and sober, and they had 20, 30 years, something, you know, I thought, and Johnny told me he would be that person, that he was going to be that person, and I believed it. I had so much, I looked at that man twice my age, you know, I was 25, looking at this man twice my age, and I saw hope, and like, promise, I had so much hope. Security cleaned up after him, changed his pants in front of me. He has out his own sick. You know, and then he'd walk around saying he didn't have a problem. Until he did. Until he couldn't support it anymore and he'd get clean and he'd get sober. And then he was this thing again. This thing that made me feel so 